I ate shit in my last video on this bike because of the slick tires. Oh, cool little turn though. Oh. And I don't really want to ever ride this off-roading, so. I have my razor here. This is also on slicks, so it doesn't really help the fact that I'm going to eat shit. I might eat shit still on this, so I got a new bike. Oh, oh my god. It was new, but I got an SX500. I'm going to completely make this my off-road bike because I'm not using the Talaria. So, converting the RSF to the SX. Let's get it So, I did get this bike used and it is a complete mess. So, first things first, we're cleaning it. <laughs> so, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like stickers on my bike. So, I'm gonna keep the two because it looks kind of cool, but I'm gonna take these ones off because. What really is the SX500 McGrath? Shut up, I don't care. I'm gonna hit up my boy Miles. He got this like sick ass custom decal on his SX, but it is so far. So, one way Miles, I need that Intel, bro. Dang, this is gross, bro. You wanna know what cleaning product would be better if you used? What? Charge PEV. Charge PEV. <laughs> I was actually debating on getting that. Cause that shit actually looks like it works really well. So I might. So, and I watched the Ronster's little interview video. Please don't discontinue it. Continue it. Charge PEV is such a sick ass brand for you. All right, first things first, we're gonna strip the SX first. I'm not trying to show the whole process because I'm not trying to make this video an hour long. So we're just gonna show the main stuff. Let's get it done. Bike is stripped. Time to strip the RSF. Ah, <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> but anyways, I was gonna finish building my bike, but John Fomo is getting an SX also. So we're gonna pause this. Let's go get your bike, bruh. I was just out working in the heat and there's no AC in this car. Yes, there is. Not well, back here. There's no AC back here, but there's AC up there. But I don't feel it back here and I'm hot. Oh, I should have just stayed home. You guys suck. That's fucked up. What with you? <laughs> yeah, well, you had AC, all right? <laughs> I'm fucking dying back here, man. <laughs> all right, 15 minutes later, I uh, just texted the guy that we're here. He says he'll be over in five minutes. You know nice. How, you know how to check a bike? I don't know how to check a bike. No. I just take apart bikes. I just don't know what, to, what I'm looking at. <laughs> hey, I got it. They don't know. <laughs> hey, you, you won't climb it. No, I'm just scouting it like I'm not going <laughs> to climb it. <laughs> Too much sarcasm in this one. <laughs> this is officially my new SX500. All right. All right, I'm back. Now I got to finish this build. Because Dylan wanted to get a bike too. Bro. I was FOMO. <laughs> I gotta take off the front suspension on both the bikes, and they should be easy to slap on right away. There we go. That definitely smashed my toe. What ah, happened? Damn it! I tightened it way too much. My clamp on my suspension snapped. I don't know if you guys can see it, but right there it snapped. Alright, it's been a couple of days now. I did not like the stance on the suspension. The rear stock suspension is not it. So, uh, I got a package from Electron Co. We got the new DNM rear shock. Dude, it's gonna feel so much more better. It was very short in the rear and tall in the front. So, hopefully, this evens it out. I have no clue which way it really goes. Like, does it go this way? I know it doesn't go this way because it hits, but. This. Do it like that. Oh, look, look, look. Then the it look sits right, so I'm assuming. Yeah, that's what I was just like about to say. It sits kind of right, so. Yeah, it's anyways. Uh, don't roast me if I don't know what I'm doing, but <laughs> I think it's this way. <laughs> All right, dial test. Turn your mic up. One, two. 
Ooh. Ooh. That rear shock really took that hit. <laughs> Yo. Dude, look at the size comparison. Oh yeah, my look, god. So you, yo, it's actually a good comparison. You can see it. The stock versus the normal height or the upgraded height. Holy shit, that's like an easy two and a half inch difference. I'll probably say more. Especially with this upgraded pro taper bars to a ride or die suspension and a DNM rear shock. <laughs> ah, it's no longer a kid bike. <laughs> what do you oh, think? Bike? Oh wait, what? What? Yeah. That's crazy. Not doing it. It looks so real, different. Natural. It is, huh? The old friends over there. It's kind of sad. Yep, she's evolved. A new era. <laughs> <laughs> it needs more back. red. It does need more red. I'm more gonna do. Red. I'm gonna do a whole little custom decal. That's another video. But I'm gonna do a whole custom decal. Okay. Well. Give me a So rip RSF. No, nah, we still got hers. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. All right, we're not gonna do that much of a ride, but I do want to ride it still, so time to switch to the GoPro. All right, let's go. Oh shoot, I probably uh, should get my keys. I think I have it here. Yeah, I do. All right, let's go. I shouldn't be doing this to my camera, but I'm too lazy to go inside. <laughs> All right, don't mind the, the mess in the yard. Uh, we're doing a little yard sale, so do, do not mind that. You got the dirt tires, you already know I gotta try it. <laughs> but dude, it looks so good. Yeah. How's it look? Dude, it looks well, fire, huh? It's way better than an RSF. Really? Way better. <laughs> Holy shit, bro. Yeah, you know what I feel like right now? I feel like one way miles. <laughs> Oh, let's go up here. Let's go. I got little off-road tires. The whole reason why I wanted this build was because I wanted some off-road tires, not some slick. So these tires are kind of shit, but let's see how it rides. Oh, oh, yeah. Slicks, I would have slid out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is nice. This is really nice. Oh, this is really sick. Oh, shit. oh dude. Yeah. Look, he's still way back there. I can't keep up with you. <laughs> oh, let's mob. We're mobbing. Oh, dude, this feels nice. <laughs> oh, shit, bro. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It's drifting. Yeah, on the RSF, oh, my back tire will be like <laughs> drifting. Oh, look, I'm not even drifting back here. Oh, 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 oh. Dude, it feels so good. <laughs> oh, yeah, bro. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we out, we out here. We out here. Oh, shit. <laughs> He's still coming. <laughs> the difference between slicks and off-road tires, huh? You gotta slow down, man. Your filmers with you. <laughs> Bro, I was out of there. I wanted I'm to like, feel it. Dang, you're dipping right there. <laughs> I wanted to feel it, dude. It feels nice. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Off-road tires are so much better than fucking slicks. So much better. Look at this. I'm dipping. Usually right now on the off-road tire or in the slick tires, I'll be sliding out on the back like drifting a little bit. But here, let's see how I take this turn. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh dude, it's nice. It's actually really nice. It's really nice. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Dude, this is the the off-road tires are such a must if you're gonna be doing like anything but street. Oh, oh, I should have got these earlier. 
but I started on the RSF, so it only made sense that I had slicks. And then I got a Talaria that came with slicks. Completely different game, but... Oh man, actually, I love this off-road tires, bro. They're so nice. Yeah, dude, Dylan, off-road tires on this was so fun. You see me just mobbing on this? Yeah, I know. I'm like, bro, he's flying. And dude, try it. Right try it. No, let me build mine and then... All right. Then <laughs> yeah, you're, you're going to probably like yours better. Oh. You're probably gonna like yours better though. So this is Dylan's bike that he's been building. I've been getting a lot of comments on my YouTube channel about your bike. How about mine? <laughs> yeah, wow. Dylan's got the 76 fall with the EC4P V2. He doesn't have the new one. He's gonna be upgrading to the 5P soon, I, I think. Yep, I don't know. Yep, yep, it's gonna be on my new bike hopefully, but. Yeah, Dylan just got a new SX500 too, so Dylan and I are both gonna be on SXX. <laughs> oh my God, I can't even say it right. Dylan, <laughs> I, Dylan and I both are gonna be on SXs. <laughs> But I'm just what I'm concerned about is I have all these buttons, right? So like my head. Yeah, I have it too, but I don't know where to put it. Should we drill it into the plastic from here? Like, what do you guys think? Yeah. What do you guys think? Yeah, <laughs> where should we put that? So these little gadget things or whatever, they need to be screwed in, like these little power buttons. But I have it too, but I don't know where to put it because it turns on my headlight. My headlight doesn't work right now because there's no switches. But what do you guys think we should do? Should we put it on here or on top of here or I see people drilling inside the seat? I'm I see just people drilling them right here, but it kind of ruins the. I know, like I wanted this to be seat. clean. Like I don't want anything, so I might just like you know, maybe put it like right here in the front. Ah, oh, that's too much. Like right here in front. Uh, the... then your buttons will get dirty because I could smack. I think I should dirt. do it like right here, you guys. Look, but it kicks me down. Like we could even do it like. Maybe like some of these circles will take them out to you know just replace it, make it look somewhat similar to that, or just all right here, maybe. Like how my RSF was. You know how it shouted like ding 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 ding. Maybe all right there. Cause it is naked, you know. Yeah. I would keep these stickers on here so like it looks like a kid's bike, you know? Keep nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it out. You know me, nah, I don't like my stickers, bro. Hell no. I wasn't gonna hit you. Oh, this is like you said. I've actually never ridden up this because I have slick tires, but now I can. Oh. Ah, you broke your chain. Oh damn. How the heck? How did that happen? <laughs> That's not good actually, because what if I'm like off-roading and shit? And then you just put your chain back on. Yeah. I... Oh, do you know what I've always wanted to try? I think I could do like a 180. You know, I used to do it on a BMX, but... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> never again. We're never doing that again. Sorry, buddy. Oh, my bar's already bent, too. God damn it. I really feel like I've seen my I've said my outro like a million times, but if you guys have made it this far, please just like and subscribe. It only helps the channel. Until next time, I'm gonna be off-roading this thing with new tires because these new tires are kind of booty, but we're gonna have some new tires on this. We're gonna take this off-roading. It's gonna be fun. No more Tellari on the trails. <laughs> Let's go, I'll see y'all later.